nighttime skincare is your favorite routine, you clicked on the right video. Hey y'all, hey, if you're new, hi, if not, welcome back, babes. Today we're going down the list of my favorite nighttime skincare items. Let's get started with double cleansing. Starting with Clean Skin Gel Cleanser with Prebiotics from the Sephora Collection. It works for all skin types. And best if you have pores, dryness, acne, blemishes, or you can use it as a makeup remover. This cleanser has two things that my skin cannot live without. One is, it's a gel cleanser. Once I learned that my skin loves gel cleanser and I am a sucker for things with a good lather, she's a keeper. The second thing is, it has aloe vera, which is a perfect natural moisturizer. Aloe vera maintains hydration, which we always need all year round, but especially in the colder seasons. The Inkyless Salicylic Acid Cleanser. It works for all skin types, best for acne and blemishes, and it's also a lightweight gel formula. Besides any breakouts that I get, I love that this works well for blackheads. And oil control for my T-zone area. They both are great, lightweight, affordable cleansers. I am new to the liquid exfoliating world, but Paula's Choice Skin Perfecting BHA 2% Liquid Exfoliant is perfect. It works for all skin types, best for pores, uneven texture, acne, and blemishes. What I love the most about this is it assists in brightening my dark spots. I want to put a disclaimer out there just based off of my experience. If you have slightly sensitive skin or if you're not necessarily acne prone but you do get hormonal acne and dark spots, be sure to use this about two times a week. I got very excited and I started just using it daily. My skin got sensitive and a little dry. We got her back plumped and hydrated but just to put that out there. No beauty clay mask. Great for oily skin and acne prone. It draws out impurities, oil, while it detoxifies and reduces pigmentation. You can also use it as a spot treatment and it flattens the heck out of that pimple. Thayer's Hydrating Milky Toner. Wow. Great for all skin types, alcohol free, and also is best for sensitive skin. The combination of the milky and the hyaluronic acid leaves the skin smooth and glowy. Two acid treatments. First is the Hero Cosmetics Pimple Correct. It helps prevent the pimple from coming to the surface or it helps to get rid of the pimple. Next is HERS Fast Fader Spot Corrector. Can be used on all skin types. It has this word right here. And that key ingredient is used to assist in fading the spot. Cococine Chlorophyll Discoloration Serum. Chlorophyll for the skin, girls. It's great for all skin types. Cococine's ingredients are very clean. And once this goes onto the skin, you would have thought that the nighttime routine was already done. I promise you. That's how luscious and plumped it makes the skin look and feel. The Inkyless Brighten Eye Eye Cream. Great for dark circle and it brightens the under eye. Helps with uneven texture and it's fragrance free. Elf Holy Hydration Daily Moisturizer. I live by the entire Elf line, by the way, guys. It's hydrating AF. It gives an amazing glow, very youthful look. Here's a tip. Elf is a great Neutrogena Hydro Boost do. I use the face cream, I use the eye cream, I use the moisturizer that has SPF. Elf Holy Hydration Gel Yeah Moisturizer. Great for oily and combo skin. Very lightweight jelly texture. The difference between this and the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Moisturizer is this actually sticks to the skin whereas the Hydro Boost is a little bit more water-based. I believe what actually sticks to the skin in the e.l.f. may be the squalene. They both leave a very fantastic glow. Fenty Plush Pudding. I filmed an honest review where I compared the Fenty Plush Pudding to the Laneige Lip Mask, and I quite frankly like Fenty a little bit more. 
I'll be sure to link that review down below for you guys in case you're interested. It is very hydrating. If you have darker lips, meaning like smoker's lips, it will also assist in brightening. Thank you for watching. I do hope this video helped you in any way. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and click that notification bell to keep up with me, and catch you guys next video.